We should have brought the boat so we could have filled it up too. Drivers were shocked today as gas prices at a motor mart on Evansville's east side dropped from 349 a gallon to just 238 a gallon from 2 to 4 this afternoon. Yep. Sonia Brackett uh, lives in Evansville and took advantage of the deal, filling up a truck. She says the bill usually hits the triple digits. I feel great about that. I get tired of filling vehicles up at over $100, and it looks like I just hit $57.84 on a truck that usually costs us about $150. Another driver, Teresa Grant, also lives in Evansville. She says it usually takes $40 to $60 to fill up her car. That's amazing. It's going to cost me... Twenty-four seventy-nine to fill up my car because now I can go to places that I need to go to, like doctors or wherever I need to go, and take my daughter. Americans for Prosperity contacted the Motor Mart on North Burkhart Road, asking them if they wanted to be a part of the Cross of Washington national tour. Since June, the organization has been traveling to the 36 states where they have a chapter and dropping gas to $2.38 a gallon, nearing the average price of a gallon on the first day of the Biden administration. At first, they planned to make 20 to 30 stops. It's ballooned fast because we saw the need, we saw the interest, and, and obviously the people coming in for the cheap. And now they've made over 100 stops, eight of which are here in the Hoosier State. Um, there's always lines, always people wanting to come. Josh Webb is the Indiana Director of Americans for Prosperity. He says he hopes events like this helps connect the community to local legislators. So to highlight the policies that we think are causing inflation across the economy and to connect them to the good policies that we hope will keep these prices low permanently. The group says their last stop in Indiana will be in southern Indianapolis. In Evansville, Ann Powell, Eyewitness News.